Meanwhile, at Villa Park, Hugo Ekiog came face to face with his old club for the first time since joining Borough for £8 million. He was up against former Borough man Paul Merson. Manager of the month, Terry Venables, meanwhile, was out to extend Borough's unbeaten run to 12 matches. Borough already boasted the Premiership's longest run without defeat. Mark Sforks have played a key part in establishing that record, and the Borough keeper once again made a solid start, and he kept out an early effort from Lee Hendry. Christian Carambo had Borough's best first half effort when he had Villa keeper David James at full stretch. Then came a breakthrough by Villa. Steve Staunton's corner picked out Steve Stone, who made it 1 0 with a well placed header. It was Stone's first goal at Villa Park in over a year. Venables instructed the Borough players to use their heads. And that's exactly what Hugo Ekihog did in the second half. In a carbon copy of Villa's goal, the big defender got up well to make it all square. And silenced the Villa fans critical of his departure four months earlier. Borough were denied their chance to claim all three points when a powerful surge by Phil Stamp was halted by Stone. The Borough fans waited for the penalty decision the referee Clive Wilkes ignored the appeals. A lucky escape for the home.